emerging stock uh, nowadays to get the more production people are uh, not interested to be growing uh, the traditional varieties mostly they depends on the hybrid varieties only because comparatively the native and local varieties the hybrid varieties are giving more production so that people are completely depends on the hybrid varieties comparatively the native so that slowly the local and native varieties are decreasing in number there may be a chance to be uh, uh, extinct the species also because whenever completely depends on the hybrid varieties right the day will come definitely right <coughs> so it is a <coughs> responsibility of the people those who are maintaining uh, the animal husbandry they need to keep the local and native varieties also right and now uh, chilka buffalo this is a special kind of a buffalo we can see chilka buffaloes chilka buffaloes are nothing but the buffaloes which are in the odisha the state of uh, odisha in the odisha state uh, these are a special kind of uh, buffaloes these are living nearby chilka lake nearby chilka lake so these these buffaloes usually they are feeding during the night time only and particularly near the chilka lake they are eating the grass and other things near the chilka lake so whole night they will be spent there only in the very next day morning they are coming back to their houses right <coughs> so whenever they are eating the grass near the chilka lake near the near the chilka lake they are giving a milk a different kind of milk generally generally milk is in the little white in color white in color and also little sweet in taste sweet in taste naturally the milk is a sweet in taste without adding any sugar or any kind of things right <coughs> but the chilka buffaloes which are feeding the grass near the chilka lake and uh, giving milk which are having little salty little salty the taste of the milk before they are boiling when you taste it you can feel the little salty right because of this speciality of this milk without preservation without refrigeration the milk can be stored up to 7 days up to 7 days we can we can preserve without refrigeration right i think for this breed we need not follow the pasteurization method because of some salt content whenever salt content is present in the milk it avoid the entry of the spoiling bacteria then automatically they can be preserved for 7 days this is a speciality of uh, chilka buffaloes in odisha later in some villages we are seeing that the buffaloes are not treating as an animals they are treating them as a part of their family part of their family the recent uh, in one movie also be they are showing that the animals they may be um uh, hanged in the in the uh, houses it seems right but along with the family members they can be uh, shed such be constructed inside the house right in particularly some villages we are seeing still also uh, they are feeling that like uh, the family members and people they are keeping names to the cows and buffaloes also when the owners they are calling them with the names so they are responded they are coming to them this is what we are usually saying that right and during the festivals like a sankranti and specifically some festivals they decorated these animals and they are praying them like a god right so it's not only an animal it's a part of their family for right and uh, by doing animal husbandry what are the uses we have discussed already the animals are domesticated for food milk and transportation right and not only that not only that we are seeing that the animals and uh, <clears throat> the meat we are using milk we are using and also uh, the skin of animals skin of animals we are using for leather goods leather goods right <coughs> and the bones also 
bones of the animals also we are using as a natural manure natural manure right and uh, the cow dung we are knowing that cow dung and uh, uh, cow urine cow milk the curd prepared from the cow milk and ghee these are five most important things are there we are using those five products from the cow are generally called as a panchagavya panchagavya pancha means five the five products from the cows five products from the cows we are using as a natural manure natural manure right so this is also be one of the use we are getting from the animal husbandry and also we see that <clears throat> the cow dung used in the villages we are observing that cow dung cakes cow dung cakes in the sense of they may be hang on the walls it seems after drying this cow dung they are using as a fire <coughs> right using for a fuel as a fire fuels right like a wood it seems right and also uh, from the cow dung we can produce the, the biogas also we can produce the biogas so we can produce the biogas also from the cow dung there is a little process is needed this biogas we can use as a domestic gas and also we can produce the electricity from the cow dung electricity from cow dung so many uses are there by the animal husbandry so that uh, uh, the government also taking step towards the uh, the people those who are maintaining the animal husbandry they are giving little subsidy for uh, of purchasing all these things right <laughs>